So I am so excited to be sharing you guys my new small business. I did start a candle business. This is what they look like. I have literally been working on this for a year now and I love them because I feel like it incorporates a candle and decor because of how like minimalistic and cute they are. I feel like they're also really cute decor around the house. These are some other ones that I have been working on. The thing that I love about this is I did everything myself literally from my kitchen. So this started off as a hobby and I thought that um, you know, it was just something fun to do and then I posted a reel of it. People really liked it So I decided to take it serious once I seen like how many people liked them and how cute they came out But once I started doing them, I learned that it was a lot harder than I thought I thought, you know, it's just making candles. It's gonna be really easy But it definitely was a learning process, but I finally got it down to a science So I am gonna show you guys like a quick little video of how I make each candle by hand the first step of making the candles is to wick the jars. So I'm just gonna make sure that the wicks are secure at the bottom and then I put a popsicle stick to keep them centered. After that, I'm going to cut the wax and weigh it. After I'm done weighing it, I put the wax inside the melter and then I start pouring out the fragrance. I do use clean scents, meaning that all the fragrances that I use are free of harmful chemicals, typically found in other candles. After that, I'm gonna cut the dye. The colors may vary slightly because I am cutting each color by hand and just eyeballing it, but they always come out nice. After the wax hits a certain temperature, it's time for me to pour in the fragrance and the color, and then I'm just gonna wait for the whole entire wax to melt. Once the wax melts, I pour it inside of the pitcher, and then from the pitcher, I pour the wax inside the jar, and then after that, I let them dry for a full 24 hours. The next day, I come back and hit the top of each candle with the heat gun just to get out any imperfections, and then I'm gonna let it dry for another day. While the candles are drying, it's time to make the molds. So I'm just gonna repeat the same process that I did, melt the wax, add the color, add the fragrance, and then once that's ready, I'm gonna pour the molds, let them dry, and then pop them out. I have to be super careful with this part not to mess up the molds, and if there's any imperfections, I will cut them on the side with the blade. Once the molds are done and it's been 24 hours, I'm gonna hit the top of the candle with a heat gun once more, but this time I'm just getting it wet so that I can lay the molds on top and they can stick once I stick those molds on that's where they're gonna stay so I have to be very fast and careful and then I'm gonna let those dry again for another 24 hours after that they're completely dried and cured and they're ready to get their labels and warning stickers at the bottom this is how the candles look once they are completely done I love the black ceramic jar it looks super modern and then with the molds it makes it fun and cute as you can see, the whole process of making the candles does take several days and it is a lot of work. I have been at this for about a year now, like I said, and it's been super hard, I'm not gonna lie, like trying to perfect the formula and everything, especially as a first time mom and being pregnant. So I'm so happy that I didn't give up and that it finally is here and I'm able to share it with you guys. So I hope you enjoy them as much as I do. Okay, you guys, so that's my little candle making process in my candle factory, AKA my kitchen, but um, I just, Really hope you guys like it. I will leave my Instagram and my website for the candles. It's at funsense.shop. So like I said, I'll have all that linked below. And I'm really, really excited because I literally have been working on this forever and I feel like it's my second baby. I also want to launch new candles for each season and holiday. So I'm really excited to like play around with different scents and different molds and just get really creative and have fun with it. I hope you guys like it as much as I do. If you get them, definitely make sure to tag me so I can repost it. But that's pretty much it, you guys. I know this video was super short. I just wanted to like announce to you guys what I've been working on and then also in the future if you guys do want like a more business video on it and like the business side of it like how I created my website got my professional photos and like dealing with the money side of it and everything because I know I always get curious about that let me know that's something I'll have to do in the future because I'm literally just like getting my feet wet but I hope you guys liked this video and like the candles and if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel thank you